Welcome back to another Unturned video. Today we're going to go on an extremely pay-to-win Washington server where you can literally purchase admin for a very small price and we're going to do one of the best rec searches I have ever done as a solo. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more similar videos in the future, make sure to drop a like, let's aim for 500 likes. Subscribe as well if you haven't already, each one helps the channel grow a ton. Last video I announced a mythical giveaway and this is the winner. To claim a prize, please join my discord at discord.gg slash ldg and contact me over there. Today we're going to throw another one which is a freezing crown. To win this mythical, make sure Sure that you have liked, subscribed, and comment something below. Show sure members also have a higher chance of winning. So if someone wishes to become a member, the link will be in the description below. Today's video is sponsored by D Corp. D Corp is a new Nintendo Switch game, which is an arena mode game that introduces PvP. This game is a crazy co-op game for up to four players. You can play as a team of cute, customizable robots. You can fulfill the corporate dreams of your brainy boss, and you work together on tasks such as turret maintenance and harvesting natural resources while being under continuous attacks by alien cacti. Some features include 4 players, true local play or stream remote play, you can experiment with different defense plans, you can throw your friends into deadly acid pools, you can find, unlock and wear dozens of shiny hats, you can scrap all resources and carry them back to your recycler, you can reload, maintain and relocate a variety of turrets to protect your operation, you have to fetch ammo in time before the turrets run out, you can also throw it if you have to. If you guys have played Overcooked, Unreeled and It Takes Two, you would honestly love D Corp. Me personally, I've played this and it honestly seems a lot of fun, especially with friends. Make sure to join their Discord community as well, the link will be in the description too. And this game is currently available on the eShop at a discount. Links will be all in the description below and let's get straight into the video. Alright boys, we are visiting one of the most pay-to-win servers out there. A Russian pay-to-win where you can buy admin, you can buy god knows what ranks. But you know me, I'm not gonna buy anything. I'm actually gonna try to kill every single one that I can possibly see. Obviously, I'm gonna be solo. Now, this server does have some kits. Nothing that crazy. There is a base kit, which is once every three days. It's just a bridge base, though, so it's quite weak. But we're gonna build one probably somewhere around here. Pretty sure it's a one by one base. Yeah, it's only a one by one. We'll build this. As soon as we build this, then we'll probably loot a bit of military, try to get ourselves some higher tier weapons, and then we will start doing uh, some admin hunting. Let's put the door. Now, these type of servers, I'm not really a fan of, especially since in the first two minutes in the server where they have a base with lockers and everything. But then again, if we do manage to kill admins, and if they have extremely high tier loads, then it'll be worth it. My ultimate goal in this is to make an admin rage quit, which probably never happened, to be honest. Right, so I'm gonna head straight to the helicopter crash site. I'm gonna hope that there's a mega zombie over there. Loot is pretty much high as well, so if there's a mega zombie, he's gonna have pretty much high loot. Guaranteed that we can get something to raid with. Now on the server, or something else that is kind of cool, actually, I kind of do like it, is that in airdrops, you can get items from other maps. So for example, you can get a flamethrower for France. You can get Genogovers. You can get those laser guns as well. So if we do manage to get that kind of loot, it'll be pretty epic. Alright, so I did just loot the heli. I got myself a Heartbreaker, Avenger, and the Raw Explosive. That is pretty much it. Now I'm gonna go straight to Seattle, which is usually where all of the PvP is. If I die, I die. I do have some armor with me as well, but if I do get some kills, then that will be pretty epic. Also, we're gonna try that Zero Deaths Challenge, where basically we don't even die once. Probably will be an ultimate failure, to be honest, because on these kind of servers, it's very hard. You already hear shots. But if we do manage to do that, then that would be kind of epic. Well, now it seems clear, actually. Oh, never mind, there's somebody with a light. Oh, he's right there. Oh, he's dead, and yeah, he has Banshee. This is a kit that everybody can get, by the way. And the Banshee is a very, very fast weapon. Okay, well, let's go up. Oh, I fell off. Let's check out if there's any high tier loot on these two military spawns. Maybe we'll get lucky and get a Dragon Fang, but it seems empty. Yeah, there's more shots. That was gonna go off where. Let's check out where that was. Oh, yeah, he's coming right over here. Yeah, he killed somebody. Bro, die. There we go. Oh yeah, he has a- oh, dude, Maple Strike, there we go, Devil's Bane. You know, just killed the high tier dude then, gonna go off where? Alright, let's drop that, let's put the Maple and the Devil's Bane in there. But already, we already got ourselves a high tier loot, man. I swear to god, every time I kill a high tier player on the server, they always have a Maple Strike and the Devil's Bane. So I'm pretty sure that's a pay to win kit that you can get. Alright, so we're currently homing, I don't wanna depot this, I don't wanna die. Because we did get ourselves some pretty good loot. Bunch of raw, so let's salvage all of these. Hold on, actually, let me wear... Alright, let's put all of this inside our crates. Let's salvage all of those clothes. Let's make ourselves some meds. We need the med kit. Let's put the Devil's Bane ammo. Put the Spec Ops vest. Let's salvage the Desert Helmet. Alright, let's salvage the Avenger as well. 
And then we could stack all of the metal. For ourselves another elite spec too, that's pretty nice. Some more shots, yeah we cannot salvage those iron sights. Let's drop these from our vault so that we have an empty vault, just in case we kill somebody else and we need to vault something quickly. Put all of this in there, let's put the drum. We're still gonna go with the red little snake, obviously. Alright, so I bought myself a blowtorch. The server does have a shop. Right, we need more bars. Alright, we got ourselves another locker, lovely. Put that right over there. Put the elite spec, the napalm tank, blowtorch, we don't need those. I'll put the Ellie spec as well, I don't wanna lose it. We just run around with the black travel pack for now. I know it's gonna be a bit of a problem, to be honest, on this gun. Let's organize inventory a bit, we'll get ourselves a drum, and just fill it up, and we go back. There's a guy with a dump truck. He is dead. Yeah, everybody in the server just has any vehicle you want, man. He had a gas gun and a blowtorch. Nice. That's basically it. Now, when I dropped it, land in Seattle, I don't know if I should go for it. I do think that everybody is gonna be there, but actually, maybe I should go for it. Or at least try to get some kills. Because high tier players will go there. So if we do get to kill them. Then we'll get ourselves some good tier load. But I'm going to go around. And I'm going to try to go from the fire station. Seattle airdrop always lands between the two big buildings. So I'm pretty sure there's going to be people camping at the top. Let's give it a try man. Who knows if we die we die. You already hear banshee shots. That thing shreds man. It's such a high fire rate. Yeah the airdrop hasn't landed yet. I don't know what the zombies are doing. They're just going around? Is there an admin in Vanish? Usually that's what it means if there's zombies running around for no reason. There's an admin. Yeah, a lot of shots. There's a guy there. Alright, we got him. I hear steps on metal. There's people inside these buildings. There's a guy in there. Check out the air dra Oh, dragon. Oh my god. Wait, that's going straight into my vault. Maple strike. Let's take these. I'm gonna push these guys. There's a guy in here. Is he above? Yeah, he's going above. He's right there. He's dead. Another dragon dude, dragon fang box. I mean, let's just vault it. There we go. Bro, we got raiding. There's another dude. Oh, he's dead. Dude, rocket launcher as well. I don't have space in my vault. I'll just keep it in my inventory then. I'm gonna home. Bro, so much loot. Chainsaw, maple strike, PDW. There's a drum. A lot of shots. Bro, I can't believe we just did that. Look, at we got two dragon fangs. Rocket launcher, PW, maple strikes. That was epic. Those guys are still fighting over the airdrop loot. All right, we'll definitely go back. Let's make some more lockers first, though. Because I'm pretty sure we did leave some guns. I saw gonna go over there. But we got raiding gear so easily, man. Oh, no, we did get the gonna go over here. Where's the green skin? He's dead. All right, well, let's see what he has. Oh. Dude, Meta Morris, okay. My guy's just running around with a Meta. Bro, I'm gonna home. I'm gonna home and depot this. That's even more raiding gear. Yeah, this is another kit, by the way, for an admin or whatever his rank was. So obviously I'm running around with the gold maple strike. I'm gonna try to use it. Very good gun, especially since pretty much all of the admins and paid to win players will be running around with those. And we're gonna go back because the PvP did escalate down a bit. So maybe there's like one guy that's looting them, all of the dead people. So we'll go try to kill him. Unless he homed or something. There's a guy there. He's just jumping around. Alright, he's dead. I think he was naked though. Yeah, there was nobody in Seattle. There's a guy behind. Oh my god, he almost killed me there. Thankfully, he had a bit of poop aim. Oh yeah, the Banshee shreds, man. If he hit me one more time, I would have died there. Wait, this guy did have loads. Oh yeah, he had a Banshee kit. No, another dump truck. He's dead. I think it was the same guy we killed earlier. He's a gas can as well this time. I think he just wants to drive in a dump truck, to be honest. Alright, let's loot military. Maybe we get ourselves some high tier load. With the Dragon Fang and Rocket Launcher, I'm already really happy. There's Zubek shots. And gonna go over shots. Okay, there's some geared people then. Let's go try to kill him. He's right there. He's behind the tree. Alright, we killed him. He did see me. He has a rank. Let's go check out what loot he has. We check out what loot he has and then we home. Pretty sure there's more. And they probably know where I am. Yeah, I don't see anyone. No. They don't just come back as soon as we depose. And Zub back, very good loot. Yep, fully decked out Zub. Bunch of ranger ammo. Let's home. We're still doing the zero deaths challenge, by the way. We still have not failed that. So I'm really happy with that, actually. Yeah, we are back. Alright, it's depot. Another Zub back. Maybe I can make myself another locker, actually. Oh, there's chop trays back there. Oh, hey, insane base trade. Alright, let me make a sheet and make a place just in case. And yeah, there's loot on top. It's probably a live base. Oh yeah, there's a guy coming out. Wait, does he have nothing? Alright, let's kill him. There's a dead cow in here. Four lockers. 
Alright, let's use this plate. Let's get out of here. Right, I think they were just building. Yeah, they didn't have anything, man. Okay. Probably have stuff in those lockers, to be honest. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place a roof just in case they do come back. I can just salvage in and we get ourselves some easy loot that way. Somebody's shooting Banshee. I'm pretty sure that's a melee. Oh, there's people up there. There's two guys. Let's kill that dude. Alright, he is dead. Let's push to the side so that it won't be that easy for him to spray me down. But I gotta push before he TPs him back, bro. Oh, wait, what? Alright, he's... A guy in a dump truck. He's dead. I don't know if there was the same guy. He has heavy crossbow. Wait, was this the guy that I didn't kill? I have no idea. There's a bed back there. Let's break it. Wait, did he not have... Oh, he only had a machine gun. Okay. There's a guy there. He's dead. Another dude. That as well. I think this was the same people I just killed. I'm not sure actually. There's more though, so I'm gonna not loot them and just. Yeah, third dude dead. Damn, we're killing everyone today, bro. No death challenge as well. You had rattlesnake. Slow the guy up here. This guy had banshee kit. There's more people. There's a guy there. He's dead. Another dude there. Dead as well. Let's go. There's another guy there. Oh, I ran out of ammo, man. I didn't have anything, though. I think he only has a heavy crossbow. Oh, he hit me. Oh, that was close. I almost died there. I smed up and back up. Because I don't know where I'm getting shot from. Bro, he's hitting me over and over. This guy has good aim, man. I'm still uh, alive. I don't know where he is, though. Alright, so I did actually home because I was running out of ammo. But I'm gonna go back. Hopefully that guy is still there, man. That guy was hitting everything. It was crazy. There's a guy there. Alright, he's dead. My guy was just chilling on the roof. I think he was zombie raiding this. Yeah, he could easily zombie raid this, I think. Do zombie yeah, there's a zombie right here. He doesn't have anything, though. What does he have? A monster key. Yo, insane loot. There's a guy there. He's dead. I'm pretty sure he only had heavy crossbow kit. Yeah, nothing else, though. Oh, I'm dead. What? Alright, he shot me through the thing, but... Bruh, I did not know that he was even in there. Alright, well, there goes our zero death challenge. That sucks, man. We lost the maple, but it's fine. We still have one more in our base. There's two guys up on that hill. Alright, got myself the Banshee kit. Let's chase them down. Yeah, they have no clue about me, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there's right over there. Let's get closer. Yeah, they stopped. Alright, both dead. He has an ace, and this dude has Ego Fire. Oh, well, that's nothing really that good. Oh, there's a guy chilling. I think he's just building a base. Yeah, he's over there. He is dead, he has, uh, okay, chainsaw, peacemaker, that's literally, I'm getting shot at, where's the guy there? Ow, he almost killed me, bro. Alright, he's dead. If he had one more time there, I probably would have died. Eagle fire, heartbreaker, two eagle fires, I don't know why he didn't use the heartbreaker, man. He could have easily killed me if his gun was on auto, rather than semi, but I guess it's my lucky day. Alright, there's people there. He's dead. Bro, the Gana War is so good, man. It's like Maple Strike, except with a fire with a higher fire rate. Honestly insane. There's another guy though. Let's kill the zombie. Yeah, somebody's with a heartbreaker. Saber tooth. Oh, there's a lot of people then. Let's kill this dude first. Where the hell oh he's there? Oh my god, he almost killed me, bro. Surprised how he didn't, to be honest. Let's kill the zombie. He has Heartbreaker. A bunch of ammo. It's for this dude. Saber suit. Yeah, I think I killed them all then. Alright, W. I'm pretty sure there's a guy down there. I think he's hiding though. I think he knows that I'm up here. There's a guy up there as well. And he's dead. So I just rush him down. Yeah, zombie is pushing him. Yeah, he's outside. The zombie is making him run out. Yeah, he's dead. He has a rank. Oh, two, vi four vipers. Probably like ten vipers. Let's take that box. I'm full of loot, man. Let's kill this dude. Alright, so I've been upgrading base a bit. Made myself another one by one at the side. I'm gonna make myself some more storage. Put that right over there. Lovely. There's a guy in here. What? Bro, you really need to make a door, man. Yeah, he doesn't have anything. Oh, it's mad up. There's another dude chilling in here. He's dead. 
My guy has uh, Saber, Banshee, and Peacemaker. There's another loot pile here, but nothing good. Uh, Alright, so I just found this base. I'm actually gonna raid it. There's lockers inside. I'm pretty sure server has base health, so hopefully we will have enough. Hopefully we don't get counter-raided, actually. I would be pretty upset. Now we are through. Yeah, a bunch of lockers. I really want to build behind, but... They are claimed. What? Where's the claim flag? Okay, well, looks like we cannot build after us. Which is actually really bad. Let's put that for now. Bro, I don't know where the claim flag is. Oh, there's a guy back there. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he tried to counter me for sure. Yeah, Retro Snake. We gotta we gotta raid this quickly then. Should have brought my rocket launcher from Biggest Man. I would have just raided them so quickly. But it's fine, we'll be okay. Let's raid this one. Oh, rocket launchers! Bro, that's perfect. I'm gonna vault them, man. Let's put the Dragon Fang in vault. Alright, so continue raiding them. It's like a bunch of guns. Oh, Zubek. Alright, so I did depot a lot of the loot. Oh, we did get some raiding gear. The rocket launchers in my vault are honestly the best things. So take everything I did. Suicide. Got no clothes, but let's go back now. We're home. Alright, so after that, I did leave the server. We did a very, very good Rex to Riches today. Especially all of this was recorded in literally one hour. So I really hope that you guys did enjoy. If you guys do want to see more videos like this in the future, especially on these type of servers, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.